teachers want to know that they're making a difference in the lives of their students. And on February 9th, two South Carolina teachers received confirmation that they are doing just that. Kimberly Freeman, a Latin teacher at Lexington Middle School, and Lindsay Bibler, a calculus teacher at South Florence High School, were presented with the prestigious Milken Educator Award. South Carolina has been a partner with us since 1994, and today means that we have 57 recipients of the Milken Award in South Carolina. The teachers in this room, and the administrators, and our staff, and, and everybody who walks this campus every day, have a deeply embedded understanding of the importance of education. We live in a community that values education. We have support in our district level. We have support from our state government in education. And we are going to make learning in South Carolina something that's available to everyone. I think it's important to give awards to teachers like Ms. Freeman because they don't, give it, they don't get enough recognition for their work. And um, I just think that great teachers need to have great awards. Um, I had an amazing pre-calculus and calculus teacher. Um, she was so inspiring. When I watched her teach, I didn't just listen to what she was teaching, but I watched how she was doing it and her passion, and um, I just wanted to be able to do that for other people. Absolutely deserving. She's a great teacher, a great person. She's done a lot for the school, a lot for students over the years, and a lot for me. I'm, I'm, no one else is better deserving than her. This has been a very exciting day for the great state of South Carolina and for all of our wonderful teachers across South Carolina. We've recognized two of our very finest. They're fantastic teachers, and they're just the example of teachers that I see all across our state. So I wish we could do this for every teacher, but obviously we can't. But I hope you'll take pride in knowing that two of your very own have been recognized, that this day will change their life, that it sets them on a path of being involved not only on state level policy, but national level policy, and that they've gotten the recognition that they deserve. And I hope that they have inspired some of their own students in the assembly program to become teachers. That's part of this day. I want to say a big thank you to the Milken Family Foundation for supporting teaching profession and for uplifting the teaching profession. It's been a wonderful day in South Carolina.